Hello everybody, Sounded Boot here, coming to you with a new video, or series if you guys like it. So, I have start, I have got Dungeon Defenders 2, it's in pre-alpha, it's not, it's very new, and I decided to do, a to do a series on it. So, I'm gonna do a series as, um, the Apprentice, or the, basically the mage of the game. So, this is for my other character, don't worry, it's not, I didn't play with this anyway, it's one, it's level one. So, first of all, I'm gonna join it. I'm gonna do an adventure. What? Oh no, I can't do that. That's level tw uh, 20. So, if I'm gonna do. I'm gonna join the war. Oh. Uh, so, I'm, do, so I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm only gonna use the mage. I'm not gonna use any other class. I'll try to keep these videos primarily short, but I might. Some of them might get longer as I'm finishing the level. Okay, so, okay, I guess I'm by myself. I will come back when somebody joins. See you then. So, I've been waiting for a bit and nobody's been joining, so let's just start it up. Uh, do I want to do Dragonfall? I think I have to. So, I'll do Dragonfall. The Gates of Dragonfall. On normal. Okay, it's so gonna get her by your, with just me. Okay. So, there's three entrances in this level. Oh no, this is gonna get really hard. Oh, at least I get more mana. Uh, so they're gonna be coming. I'm gonna do it from here. So really the only th thing I can do is place these down and hope for the best. So I can't even upgrade them. Next time I play it, guys, I might not be going as the apprentice. I kind of like the huntress and the range, the range choice, so I might be going as the huntress. I don't know. You'll see next time I stream, next time I do a video. Okay, set this. Oh, this is gonna go really bad. It's taunting me now. I'm not going to try to be a DPS hero here, I'm just going to play the game regularly. Ooh, new staff. A better staff, too. Oh no, oh no, oh no. So this is something new, it's totems, which is like, oh, it's totems, which is, um, a little thing that just boosts your, um, boosts your stats. It's not all too good, but it's still helpful to have them. So I got to act that round. I'm gonna sell these. Okay. Now I can start doing work. So I got that, that, and that. Oh, I really wish these things would go faster. Hopefully the mage isn't going to be as terrible as it was in the last game. If you guys have played Dungeon Defenders 1, then you guys probably know that the best class to play was no matter what, I don't care if you guys don't agree with me, the best class to play was the monk. 
because the monk was overpowered when you hit the when you got the final ability. The monk's final ability, if you haven't played it, it was basically anybody that steps in there will attack his team. So yeah, it's really it was <coughs> really overpowered. Sorry about that. Oh, these things stay for 32 hours. Oh, okay. Here we go. Let's get ready to be destroyed again. If you, if you guys saw my last video about new Avalon, then you guys would know that you guys, if you if you guys saw my last video about new Avalon and you checked it out, there's been a server reset, so it probably wouldn't change anything because if anybody went on it, they wouldn't have had anything anyway. So the server reset lost me all my stuff. I might do a vi I might do a series on it now, but I'm not sure about that. I probably won't. So because I rather have, I like having a Minecraft server that I would do a series on, and then having a Minecraft server that I can just play on, not having to worry about commentating. Even though I'm terrible at commentating. Where did- what the- No, there, okay. So there's a new Ethereum hero in the fence. If you guys would like me to bring some somebody in on this series, I would be more than happy to. Probably won't be able to, but I'll try my best. So, yeah, I hope you guys are going to enjoy this, so, let's get ready. As you guys can tell from that comment, I'm, I pretty much just, I'm very picky when it comes to people that play with me because I, it's a long story. If I do any, if I do anything, they have the person has to be in a certain place so that everything is defended. It's not that I'm rude or anything. It's just that it's the way I play. Can I upgrade things? Oh, I can. I'll upgrade these things then. Here we go. So yeah, I'll probably end up switching out to the Huntress, but if you guys want me to stay as a mage, I'll be I'll definitely stay as a mage. So put you can put what you think I should do in the comments. And yeah. There's nobody coming from this side. Yeah, hey, that now they're coming. If you guys want to get in on this series, I'd be more than happy to... If you guys want to see somebody in on this series and you want to be that person, put down the comments, put your Steam name, maybe you'll get to be in on this series. This is probably going to be a mini-series that I do, it won't be like a full, full-blown series, like... Yeah. Chrome? Who's Chrome? Oh, the other person, I guess. I love the music in this game. If you guys have played Dungeon Defenders 1 and you think that Dungeon Defenders 1 is better than this game, so do I. That's, they've changed the key aspects of it, like upgrading your skills. If you, look in, if you look in chat, look at that. Look at those skills. It gives you the skills instead of you getting to... Oh, whoops. <laughs> gives you the skills instead of you actually having to add them in, taking the time. So, kind of balance it out, but I really think they changed the key aspect of the game. 
one of my favorite things in the game was getting to just upgrade my speed and upgrade my power so I could just wreck. And yeah, I did wreck. <laughs>